what's going on my brothers and sisters this is Hoffman tripping again in the village of Resident Evil to tell the truth I'm a big fan of Resident Evil franchise and I have a um, uh, kind of project coming up in my mind so I would like to play all the Resident Evil games that are remastered and recorded and share it with you I hope you're gonna enjoy it because mostly everyone loves the Resident Evil just like I do <laughs> so quick quick talking about that I just want to thank you for sticking around for supporting me dropping on the likes and comments on my videos thank you guys very much I love you and so let's dive in Long ago, a young girl went with her mother to pick berries for her father, who was hard at work. But the forest greeted them with a dark, cold silence, the bushes empty. Yet determined to find the berries, the rascal broke free from mother's grasp and vanished into the trees. Mother's worried cries faded fast as the girl ran on, over vine and under branch, and into the forest deep. Feeling strange eyes upon her, the girl recalled Mother's scary bedtime tales, and her throat became bone dry. Then the Pat Lord appeared. He greeted her warmly and bit his own wing. Come, child, quench your thirst, he said. So she drank the thick, dark blood and smiled with joy. Passing through the graveyard, menacing storm clouds loomed, and the air turned bitingly cold. The girl was shivering in her thin clothes. Then a dark weaver appeared, and with a click of his fingers, crafted mist into a beautiful dress. Come, child, warm yourself, he coaxed. So she clothed herself and smiled with joy. Across waters deep and ominous she went, hoping a boat she found would carry her home. But hunger's grip tightened and her heart grew heavy. Then the fish king appeared and offered one of his many fins. Come, child, eat your fill. So the girl ate and smiled with joy once more. Continuing on, she soon entered the forest's dark heart. Then an iron steed appeared, bearing a beautiful golden gear. The creature said nothing as the girl approached and snatched what she thought was another gift. The horse grew angry and summoned the other monsters. Terror filled the girl's heart as the wild wind rose around the beast. Suddenly, a witch appeared, dark yet regal. Gifts we gave, but more you took, she snarled. So more in turn is due. In a blink, the girl was trapped inside a mirror. There. She's asleep. What is with the creepy story? She's only six months old. Woman at the store said it was traditional. <laughs> a local tale. Besides, Rose doesn't seem to mind. Because she doesn't understand it, thank God. We moved here so that she wouldn't have to deal with any of that, remember? There's nothing wrong with my memory. You're just being paranoid. It's not... Never mind. I'm sorry. But I'm not paranoid. I'm just cautious. Then, go cautiously take your daughter to bed. Oh. I'll finish dinner. It's okay, Rose. Your mother doesn't want to remember it. I can't blame her. Did you say well, something? Nothing. I'll put her down. That was surely a creepy story for a little baby like that. I think I'm gonna go upstairs. Logically, and... Oh no. 
They're there. It's like I said to your mom. That book's too scary for you. This way, maybe? Nope. Almost there, honey. Oh, there we go. Looks like our bedroom. There you go, sweetheart. Don't you worry. I'll be right downstairs. Daddy won't let those weird fairy tale monsters get you. I want to just look around, see some stuff. Like a photo album. I wish it could stay like this forever. That's it, I guess. Books around. Gun survival is. It's not paranoia if they're really out to get you. Have you fire on manual combat situation? Okay, so he got some uh, tutorial books. Monkeys, little monkeys. Okay, what is that? February 6th. Mia and I had another fight. I accidentally mentioned what happened three years ago and she blew up at me. We finally settled down in our new life in Europe. So they're in Europe. And can bring grows up probably. Properly. No, uh, but I still feel like a part of me is trapped in that hellhole back in Louisiana. I know Mia doesn't like to talk about it, but can we really just forget everything and pretend it did not happen? Shouldn't we face that happen? What happened there so we can live our lives with Rose without it hanging our, over our heads? We all heard that much at least. I know Mia knows this too. She wouldn't have exploded like that at the hospital if she didn't care. Where exactly in Europe are we now? There's this bathroom. I'm just gonna quickly check it out. Use meditation, she is on a strict painting ever since the incident. Okay. So she's on drugs. What is this place? This might be Rose's room when she's grown up. Gotta do a deep I clean think. before Rose starts walking around. Yeah, what is that? Christian causes of the two gas incidents. What? The community completed their investigation on the 18th. Uh, into the delivered toxic gas leak in Louisiana. In, okay, that's the... It could be death of the cause of leak of uh, natural gas that had built up to... Yeah, of course it's like that. Jake Baker, 57, and his family who were exploded to the gas. <laughs> Ethan Winters and his wife were also believed uh, to be have been nearby, but their current whereabouts are unknown. The entire area has been closed off by officially who believe it will be at least 10 years before the area is habited again. Okay, Everyone's the bullshit. Everyone's forgotten about this already. What is that? Why do I even keep this around? I should get rid of it someday. Okay. I don't remember what is that, but I think it's from the last game. Yeah, I will actually make the playthrough of all the Resident Evil games. I started from the zero. I'm not gonna do Revelations and uh, Code Veronica. Code Veronica is also very old. Maybe I'll do it if they get a remake. 
Is she okay? Sleeping like a, well, like a baby. Hmm, <laughs> that smells good. What's that? Oh, hands off, mister. It's chorba de lagum. It's a local recipe. Wow, you've gone full native, haven't you? Hmm. Local wine, too. But if you're gonna keep sulking all evening, maybe you shouldn't have any. <sighs> you really have to stop worrying. <sighs> it's just finding you in Louisiana, the pregnancy, Chris moving us here, military training, it all happened so fast, you know? Well, at least we're all together. You, me, Rose. Now, everything's gonna Seriously, be- Seriously, think we can just forget about what happened in Louisiana? It happened so long ago. I just, I don't understand why you are so- <laughs> The hell? Mia, get down! Mia! Oh, God. Chris? What the hell? Sorry, Ethan. No! What? Why? Chris looks totally different from the last game. Go move! All clear. Rose? What the hell are you doing with my daughter? Package secure, sir. Take him away. I said get your hands off her! Ethan, no. Hey doc. hey, doc. Hello, Mr. Winters. I've got your daughter's results back, and I'd like you to come in to talk about that. How about next Thursday, 4 o'clock? No problem. We'll be there. That was the doc. She'll see us next week. Hey, now. Think positively, all right? We talked about this. I know. We hardly talk about anything else. Keep telling you, it's not Rose that I'm worried about. Well, then what are you worried about? Look, she's gonna be fine. I just know it. What else matters? We matter, Ethan! You matter! You just Mia, what are you talking about? Is there something you're not telling me? Come on, talk to me. Damn it. I have to take this. My little angel. Actually, she looks very realistic. A baby. All right, what happened? Very curious what is going on. The beginning intro Jesus. is straight. About damn time. What's your status? Is the package safe? What are you talking about? Where's Chris Redfield? And Rose? Who is this? This is a secure channel. You are not off the Fuck. What the hell happened here? 
So we got flashlight. And it begins. What the hell? It's a crush site. Yeah, can I take the phone? It's useless. What is this? Mission objective. Eliminate target. Recover body. Secure Rosemary, Winters and Ethan Wheaton's. Winters. Move the two Winters to site C from future investigation. At least two transport offers to accompany them. Yeah, but they still failed. You got any guns on you, dude? Of course not. Yeah, environment is made perfectly, like, so realistic. Why the flashlight is... My, damn it, I, I hate when it's like that. Automatically on the ground. Oh, this is this, uh, the trail. Tracks of somebody. Whoa, what's that? You just I hate that? I bet there's there are gonna be a lot of jump scares. To get ready. How do I get inside? Don't enter. Alright, let's crouch. Oh come on, dude, you cut yourself on the rusty barbed wire. You're gonna lose that arm. Holy shit, what is that? <sighs> Fucking hell. A dead crow. A lot of dead crows. Jesus Christ. Don't touch me, please. Oh shit! <laughs> okay, okay, so the first jump scare. Hello? Who's there? Please don't eat me. Bridge. This place is creepy. So I think we are entering the village right now. Okay, let's go. Fucking hell, look at that blood trail. Anything useful? There's a rope to hang myself. Potatoes. Which we're thirsty. And of course, there's no water. Pills. And another burp blood. Oh shit, what's that? Scary granny. The place looks like an ordinary village. House, hut, or whatever. Oh, this deer head. And a fox. And owl. They look funny. What's 
that. Well, it's like the local saint. <laughs> Not pretty at all. Can I open it and do something? No. Hey, what is that? Some kind of brand? Jesus, I don't want to look inside. That's it? Like this. Yo, Carlix. Okay, I see that. Deer head fall off. Who's there? My god. I need a weapon. Okay, it's morning. Good. Uh, I would like to have a daylight all the time. All right, we we'll climb. Okay, this is sprinting. Yeah, we have sprinting. Where the hell am I? No, oh, look at that. What a beautiful view. That is the village, I guess. <sighs> Holy crap, is that a horse? Ripped up throat. Damn it. Which really should we go inside or look around? We got a map, right? Yeah, we have a map. I better search the house because there might be any kind of weapon maybe knife or crowbar at least okay here we are hello wait I think I'm gonna go inside this house Maybe, maybe they're out. They're out. It's too. What's going on here? Damn it. Anything? Just give me kitchen knife. What happened here? Damn it. Holy crap, what was that? Was that this, this horse over there? Yeah. Somebody dragged it out. Alright. So, we are gonna stumble up to an enemy very soon. I'm, I'm getting that feeling. What is this? It's some kind of other item. It's a well? 
Okay. Nothing. Can I climb up on that roof? Okay, so this leaves markings. That is very good. But I think when it's red, you miss an item inside. There's an item inside that building. Let me see if I missed something. Maybe there's a... Right, I don't think I can grab it right now. This is an intro. Or maybe later we'll be able to come and see what's going on there. Oh, look at that. Jesus Christ. Okay, I'll, I'll check out that building. And then proceed. Yo, it's the monkey. Rose's favorite toys. Nothing, right? In the brand again. The hell is it? An embryo? Jesus, are those gold heads? What happened? Yeah, what happened? Graveyard. Workshop cemetery. Ceremony. I'm really very curious what kind of Europe is this. Missing homeowner. Patient toilets. I don't know the name of... Hey, chickens! Hello? Is that a knife? Ca oh, yeah. Finally, I got a weapon. All right, medicine. So, this is Resident Four Evil 4 inventory. Yeah, I, li I like it. I like it. Let's see it. Oh, this is crafting. We can craft ammo. Add first aid med. It's key item, treasures, okay. Also, oh, there's a treasure, so there should be this guy. Hello, stranger. Wanna buy? <laughs> Did they just run out of the house? Oh, 
Oh crap. No, no. Friendly. Friendly. Who are you? Who sent you? Nobody. There was an accident down on the road and... What's going on? Oh no. They're coming. Who is? What the hell was that? Do you have a gun? What? Please tell me you have a gun. No, why would I? Take it! Take it! Help me, it's out, bro. Hey, are you listening? Dead body? No, not just one. Wait, there's more. Holy crap. Jesus Christ. What the hell is wrong with this place? Huh. Okay, I see something. Damn it, what is that? I'll shoot you, motherfucker. Shit! Cut my fingers oh, off. What the fuck was that? No. What the fuck? Take, motherfucker. Holy shit. What the hell? The hell? Yeah. How am I doing with health? Not well. I think there was another guy like that. Like him inside this building. It's some kind of other item. Okay, I'll try to find one. What is that? Oh, it's a crafting item. Okay. And I can craft it. All right. Found what I needed.
Damn it, I don't want to go inside now. A radio? Before I go there, I'm gonna look around. A boot. The other side, okay, I gotta unlock that. What was that? And barricade. Okay, I'll barricade it. This is... <laughs> Jesus Christ, what... Oh fuck, what, I, what should I do? Face of him? Oh fuck, how do you get in? items. Is it over? Oh, I don't think so. It's just uh, getting started. Hello. If there are any survivors out there, come to my... to Louisa's house near the fields. Survivors? Okay, I'll find Louisa's house in the fields, but I gotta... Dude, at least bandage up that wound. Oh shit, look at them. Just chilling up on the roof. Oh, don't attack me, please. You want a piece of me, motherfucker? I don't have a lot of ammo and guns. Okay, so they are attacking. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, yeah. Oh, shit. Shotgun, give me that. Take it. Okay. Damn it. How many rounds I got? Two. Give me that. I need every item. Everything. Can I craft? No. Okay, they're in. Fuck off, motherfucker. Come on. Oh shit, I... Oh 
yeah. There's no end to them. Oh my god, they are coming and coming non-stop. Let's get out of here. Take it. What the hell is that? Oh shit, they're shooting arrows at me. Jesus Christ. Oh no, 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 fuck off, fuck off. Shit, what is that? What the hell is that? Just run around. Cutscene that means I'm um, okay, I'm doing well. Wait, wait. 